Hello everyone, I'm Mr. Mocha Lover, and thank you for joining me here. Today, we're going to continue playing as the New California Republic, and this is the first day back after the past, for the past three days in which I was gone. Couldn't really respond to comments. Um, yeah, so let's continue on. Something tells me that we're eventually going to get into a major conflict with at least Kaisar's Legion. So, uh, there's been quite a few comments left. I can't honestly remember all of them. Um, someone wanted me to add a sub mod into this game about me taking over Helios 1. Uh, I mean, if there's ever a sub mod someone wants me to add to the game, please let me know before I start the, start a campaign. I know I don't really tell you what I'm going to play, but I don't know if that the mod would actually work if I input it now into the game. Um, currently, as you can tell from the screen, I'm moving things around. I've adjusted my uh, military around. I've given up on the Brotherhood idea. And right now, I'm rushing some defenses to the areas of which I have boundaries with Kaisar's Legion. So, we definitely have a def defensive group here. Um, reorganize things a bit. We don't have anyone over here. Oh, Philip Papas. He's leading the NCR Heavy Troopers and some motorized divisions, which are actually pretty good motorized divisions. A little bit of armor. Not bad, not bad. Um, I was looking through the focus tree. And look at all these same... National Spirits, holy crap. I love the Rangers. I love the Rangers. Anyways, we're doing the Hero of Mojave right now. And, which is not bad, a little more, a little less division training time, a little more, slightly more population, more popularity of democracy, but I'm probably going to go with Old World Wad. I want to see if I can try to get into, or at least take over the Hoover Dam, and then we'll see what kind of happens with that, because I've never actually really done that before, so it'll be very interesting to see what and watch what happens um do that i want to make sure that we're really really well defended over here Ooh, can i actually add a bunker oh yeah that'd be great i think these probably take quite a bit of time to make though so i don't know how ferocious kaisar's legion is going to be and i also don't know if they're going to attack and invade me by the sea i want to say they're not actually yeah they probably don't have almost any ships at all but then again this is the ai we are talking about so um, it'd probably be good to place one of those things there, one of those things there. And I might attack, of course, like Hoover Dam and whatnot to control it. Um, air bases? If we get into war with Kaiser's Legion, we're definitely going to need an air base. Make like one there and then tumble, tumble, hoot right there. Cool, we're making more military factories. Uh, we got 9.87 thousand manpower. Not great, but not bad. We need more anti-tank rifles. As well as infantry equipment, but infantry equipment comes by pretty quickly enough. And we're doing pretty well in our fighters and dive bombers. I love those. We're doing very well in support equipment. We're doing scavenged power armor for pretty good effect. Uh, we could use more savaged motorcycles, though. So currently, can we do anything? No, because we're scavenging for equipment using power armor. Wait, I'm doing stage incident at Sloan Border. Um, Yeah, I, I don't want to do this anymore, so can I cancel this? I don't want to piss them off anymore. I've, I've learned my lesson. I've learned my lesson. Please. Please, no more. Well, yep, looks like we got to go through it, so. Um, yeah, I, I definitely don't want to take them over. Escalate border conflict. If not, if the thing is not selected within 28 days, I cannot stage a new incident for about four months, which is fine. I don't want to do anything with them. I've already tried them, tried to push them hard enough, so. Hopefully they won't hate us. Oh, we already don't like them. But they don't really hate us too much more. They just don't like our beliefs. But I do have to keep an eye, though, on the Brotherhood. And see what direction they are going. Because they have Brotherhood expansion, draw the sword, but they can go with old bonds. See, now, if I go to when I go to war with Kaiser's Legion... Oh, they're expanding private industry. But if I go to war with Kaiser's Legion, I do have the option of the Brotherhood joining me. So, that would be kind of interesting. Pharaoh's declared war on New Hammond. Surface tensions... Advanced communications, recruitment drive. Very nice. Pharaohs, 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 pharaohs. Oh, they're up. No, oh, new Reno still trying to conquer stuff. That's pretty bad. Can I, send, I can send Atache, maybe get a little more army experience. Is that worth it for us? I'm not really using my political power at all right now, so. I, I kind of don't mind. Do I need to. Eh, we're, okay. we're kind of okay with this. Let's go ahead and send him Atache. I mean, we don't really need the experience, but maybe a little bit more war support for them will help him out. Uh, Craig, they will receive Craig Foster. All right. Well, maybe we won't get anything from this. And also, I'm training my soldiers because some of them are just really crappy. 
Ah, oh, guys, you need air superiority. Just call me into the war. Nice, nah, we have Hero of the Mojave. I can't join their wars. And slightly, slightly... Wow! Point 15. 15,000 manpower now. Improved anti-tank. Nice. Alright, so right now, because I want to push, I just want to push, push, push um, against probably Kaisar's Legion just to start, just to get it over with eventually. I mean, yeah, there's a lot of things I could do here, but, like, I really do want to do weapon standardization because that'd be really good for equipment. But we're doing okay. I think we're doing okay overall. I think we might, it might be possible for us to go to war with Kaisar's Legion. I could be dead wrong, though. Could be absolutely dead wrong. I mean, they are pretty pretty big. They don't have a ton of manpower. They've got quite a few divisions. Actually, oh my gosh, they have a lot of ships. That's not good. Equipment scavengers return. I'm not going to read them just because this is going to be happen very often. But we get 45 manpower, a few pistols back, 45 uh, NCR salvage power armor. Nice. 200 units of pipe guns, 200 basic, basic melee weaponry, basic ballistic weaponry, 50 pipe machine guns, arm XP, army XP, and a common ballistic weaponry, and a bonus to common, common energy weapons and flamers. Nice. Awesome. That's really cool. Alright, next up. I do want to do logistic companies again sometime. Auto laser rifles. This does give you a little bit more piercing. Laser battery support. Hmm. Resource gain. Oh, don't want to do that yet. Um, cap and growth sounds pretty good to me. Construction speed. I love, love, love construction speed. I have to go with that. Anti-tank rifles. Improved anti-tank launchers so we can get even more piercing. I don't know how much armor... Kaiser's Legion is going to even have. Maybe they won't use any, but, hmm. Uh, if we're going to scavenge for something else. Power armor, vehicles, well, what? I need more equipment. Anti-tank and infantry equipment, so. Let's do scavenger equipment using vehicles. Yeah, that'd probably be okay. Awesome. Very nice, very nice. How are our people doing? Getting more training. That's good. That's good. Um, where? Oh, you guys are. Oh, you're training. That's why you're not doing so well. And it's only because of the exercise. That's good. I have these guys back here just in case they might need to be pulled anywhere else. Don't know. I put my rangers up here next to the. What is this? New California Republic? No. I'm the New California Republic. The Dam Busters. Uh, quite a bit of manpower. Quite a few divisions. So if I try to fight them. It's not going to go over very well, especially if I have only four divisions here defending. If anything, actually, I should probably try to increase the number of power armor soldiers I have here. Oh, these are not special forces. That's good. This actually, if you get more power armor the battalions, you get more defense. You use way more supply. You get a little bit more organization and HP, which is good. More reliability, a little more armor. Um, I mean, it's costly, but it looks pretty good. And I want to make sure that these guys are at least 20 width. That's not bad. Anti-tank, explosive support. Cool. Do that for now. Rangers? Oh, I already made them 40 with Rangers. Oh my gosh. Oh, you got some thick Ranger boys here. Nice. And there's only four down. Stage incident. Yeah, I'm done trying to stage incidents. It doesn't even matter anymore. Um, actually, you know what? I might just put a put an outpost here as well. Just because, you know, four divisions. As great as my Rangers are, if they get, like, bushwhacked... From these dam busters, that probably wouldn't be very good for us. I'm not gonna lie. And we're still mobilizing more people, thank god. Ooh. Right now we have a little over 1.1 million people living across all of our lands in the new California Republic. That's kinda cool. Platoon training, defense breakthrough, nice. Um, -da -dum -bum -bum. what else can I do? Ooh, infantry defense. Can I do that? Oh, yeah, let's do that. Give me more defense, guys. Make sure you guys are extremely well trained. Not bad. Soft attack is okay. HP is okay. Ooh, better radar. Thank you. Hmm. Research speed. That's nice and all. Don't necessarily have to have it at the moment, though. Sal salvage dive bombers. Better dive bombers. Salvaged. Scrap. So the one on the left is a better one. It has definitely better range, better air attack, same air superiority, better max speed, costs just a little bit more to produce, 
and has better ground attack, better naval attack, a little more agility, more air defense, and requires the same amount of serviceable manpower, which is, which just means you gotta make it. Cool. 1.46 bullet power a day. Old World Wall. Please stop training. Old World Wall. I can just annex them? The NCR scouts have identified a vast structure bringing the Mojave and the distant Colorado. The Hoover Dam. Well, the large reservoir of drinking water and the current occupants have proven the dam is a great source of electricity and a great asset for us to have. And now that actually probably unlocks... Oh, we got more scavenge equipment. Nice! But right now, that will open up a new focus tree for... Or at least focus for... Um, Kaiser's Legion. First battle for Hoover Dam. Hmm. Founding the River Patrol. Protege. Unlocks Deploy Lee's soldiers. Name Oliver Lee. Not the brilliant. He's not a brilliant of minds. Capable and tactical commander. That's nice. Founding of Port Aradesh. Two dockyards. Coastal forts sound kind of nice. Let's do that. Nice. We got that area. And they're walking away from us. Okay. Interesting. We still need more anti-tank. Totally fine. We're doing pretty well on infantry equipment. Um, ba -dum, ba -dum. Using power armor, we have a higher chance to get more vehicles. But I could use more equipment. Eh, let's get some vehicles. Because why not? Alright, guys. Please dig in. The fiends. Can I take out the fiends? I might be able to take these guys out. They don't have a lot of manpower. They don't have a lot of strength. I could move in my other soldiers to take over Vault 3. We are now boarding New Vegas, which is pretty cool. Ah, oh, Mr. House. Oh my goodness, you have a lot of natural spirits. He focuses very hard on robots, I know that. Good business. If I can maybe have some sort of alliance or something like that with Mr. House here. That'd be very interesting. Yes, I do notice that I can do free civilian factories. Oh, they went with the Joker to the King. New management. Old authority. Very interesting. The platinum chip. The vault. Vault 21. The walls of New Vegas. Huh. Oh, yes, man. Ah, oh, this, this is such a well-developed focus tree. Or at least it looks like that. First batch. Uh, well, let's see what happens. So, who's justifying? Kaiser's Legion is finally justifying on us. And, see, exactly. I took Hoover Dam, and then they're going to go to war for Hoover Dam. First battle for Hoover Dam. Triumph at the Dam. Uh, or the Burned Man, which hurts them. They get, they get Lanius. Actually, that's pretty good if they lose. Actually, they both hurt if they win or lose. Alright, fortify the Dam if they take it. Lick the Bulls. Oh, if I, if I lose, that means they triumph. That means they don't get the 2% population and better reinforce rate. They get less division training time, minimum training level. They get the annex tumble home. Huh. Tumble home. Oh my goodness. Tumble home. Poking the bear. A worthy foe. Tumble home. Where's that? Because I've got tumble... They, oh, I can't let them have this. There's no way I can let them have that. That's in their focus tree? Oh, no. How is that fair? How is that fair? It name changes to Kaisar's Landing. How, is, how would that be fair? So, basically, if I... Uh, win the battle, they just get Tumble Home. Uh, that's not very fair, not gonna lie. Even if they win, I lose Tumble Home. That's not cool. Uh... I'm going to build that up quite a bit. And just in case I lose, I'm going to start building some things up there. I don't want to lose Tumble Home. It's such a good area to have. Build that up. Build that up a little bit more. Mmm, I don't know. I'm gonna build some extra stuff there. Yeah, hopefully this will be good enough. I don't want to build Radar and Tumble Home if that means I give it to them. Build that in Blythe. Build that there. 
Uh, actually, radar would probably be very helpful right now. We have airbase down along 15. Tumble home. God dang it, tumble home. Do that. Just because, for right now, because they're just... Wait, are they manually justifying on us? No, they're just doing war for Duverham. War for Duverham? Duverham? Hooverdam. Hmm. So, with this, they have to change names. Oh, God. Well, boys and girls, we best be ready for what's coming at us. I'm going to throw ahead a few more divisions here. Oh, three more divisions over here. So, supply doesn't get eaten up too badly. And for you guys, I might have to put you guys... You guys can also stop training. Close to tumble home. Because things are going to move pretty darn quickly once we get here. So, yeah. these They can't walk over through here. So just in case. How big is Tumble home is these two provinces, I think. So give me half of you right now. And come look over here. The other half. Uh, you can come to Salton City. And you can come down to the airport down here. Cool. Just to prepare ourselves. And actually, you know what? Give me two of you guys. Actually, you know what? I want these guys to move out here as fast as possible. You don't need to stay down here. What I want you to do is stay near Hoover Dam. Uh, sure, we'll do something like that. Terrible looking thing. Never going to make any sense. Alright, you can stop training as well. Start digging a lot of ditches. Invite to faction. New, New Hammond. Oh, the pharaohs. I tried to help the people up here before, but they just died. So, I'm not even going to bother with that. <clears throat> that almost looks like the Japanese flag. Or the, Japanese, the flag of Imperial Japan. Oh, guys, you're just killing your own soldiers off, man. Colonial restoration. Oh, you're out of manpower? Come on, guys. Seriously? Seriously? Kaiser's Legion. My goal is to hopefully... hopefully Make them drain their own manpower against us. That's really my hope. Oh, God. Stage, incident, border there. I don't know if this is going to do anything, but you know what? Let's be a little bit more happy with these guys, as well as the Brotherhood. You know what? It takes a little bit of political power, 0.66. And that's okay. That's okay. Infiltration tactics, nice. More reconnaissance and more heart attack and soft attack, which is good. And, and we're done with their uh, land doctrine. Great. Great, 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 great. What does this do? Light robots. This is just loaded for robots. I don't really use these, so I want to say I can ignore this. Maybe except for Securitrons. Those are... Oh, I can't use Securitrons. I'm not Mr. House. So, upgrades. Ooh, more reliability for tanks. I don't use tanks. I have stuff over here, but... Ooh, scrap tanks. Wasteland car. Salvaged car. I mean, anything that helps us out, you know, it's always good. I hope... Oh, they'd stacked a ton of divisions here. You know what? That was a stupid idea. Um, get rid of that. Just have U13. Stay over here. And the rest of y'all... God dang it. Uh, trying to do this with too many people is a bad idea. Separate you in half, but not really half. One, two, three, four, five. Actually, you're fine like that. You come over here. Stop them over here. Do that. And then you will be under someone different. I got enough political power. Jeremy Castillo. You stay with these guys up here. If we're defending, we should be okay. If not, good God. I hope we're doing okay. I can't put forts there. Oh, they're under construction, that's why. Give me another one of these things. They have a total of 17 divisions here. That's a lot of divisions. And they're 
deadlock at the... Oh, no. The NCR election teeters on the edge of disaster, for never before has the Republic been so divided. The cumulative tests, such as the Legion and Brotherhood of Steel, have aroused such a staunch anti-war stance from many of the NCR states, which has in turn damaged trust in the central government of the Republic and its military. The Brahmins barons, who have flocked to the side of the presidential candidate Anton Flynn, squabble for power after their recent disasters. Meanwhile, all, all good Murphy preaches fire and brimstone against the war like Aaron Kimball going as far as to threaten bringing the Brotherhood of Steel into any potential conflict. Meanwhile, the charismatic Grant C. Hayes has corned the vote in the state of Daglow, and his shadowy allies begin to make their move all across the Republic. It is very possible that the election may end up being utterly inconclusive. A uh, nightmare event in the eyes of many. Will the Republic survive? Um, is this the end of the Republic? I definitely don't want that, especially if we're going to go to war with Kaisar's Legion. I gotta hold on to us together as hard as I possibly can, so... We're going to go with Kimball. Um, I don't know if that was the easy decision or the worst decision, but... Where's Paymaster Landing? Paymaster Landing. You know what? I can actually just look it up. Oh, it's over... Oh, it's down there. Oh, it's over here. Maybe some sort of coastal defense would have been okay to actually instead. Founding Port Air Dash. Add two outposts. That's not bad. Uh, well, we need to do that anyway, so. Some areas, I'm feeling okay. Other areas, I'm not feeling so okay, okay about this. Alright, well, regardless, we're going to go for war for Hoover Dam, at least for a little bit. Still, they don't have a lot of things. Um, Just in case things go south. And you know what? Things usually do end up going south. You got to stop training. Go ahead and you repair your, your little booty. You do this as well. You all, you really don't have a lot of stats. I want you all to do patrols down here and here. These are the only areas that can reach us through sea. So. And go ahead and repair. There you go. Ship's repairing. Super heavy battleship. They'll be done so super quick. Nice. Doing outrig canoes. Very good. Very, very good. Alright. Well, we'll see if we're going to end up in a war against Kaisar's Legion. Proving relations with white legs. Uh, how's my relation with the Mojave chapter, not bad. Oh. Uh, we're doing much better with the Brotherhood. Whew. So the NCR is victor victorious. Our forces have held out at the dam and the Legion is clearly wounded. Though we've already been victorious, Chief Ranger Hanlon warns that the Legion will not be stopped now. He says we should press on, wipe out their forces, and prepare for the coming war by taking Bonelli Landing. Where is that? Become owner and controller of Hoover Dam. Become controller and owner of Boulder City. Uh... Huston. What is this? Yuma. There's a legate camp. Fortification Hill. Fortifier position. Defensive Bonelli landing. Well, I mean, honestly, I can't push that hard across the river into wherever the enemy's at. So, I'm going to say fortifier position right now. We can always push ahead later. And actually, my plan is to build as many planes as humanly possible now. Or at least build more planes. Uh, I will lose Tumble Home, which is going to be a disaster for me. So, we've already bought things over here. Not bad. Raider Station. We only give them one, level 1, but we will have level 2. I'm probably honestly going to need more infrastructure down here. Oh, I definitely need some infrastructure down here. Oh my gosh, look at Hoover Dam. It's so beautiful. Oh, look at those supplies. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Wow, we really built up Los Algodones. And we can do some more factories. Cool. Um, since we're going to lose Tumble Home. Where is that? Where is their dinghy? Ah, oh, so I have to go with Burned Man now. And then lick the bull's wounds so that they get even better. And then I really don't like that they become controller and owner of Tumble Home. Like, that doesn't make any sense. But five elite infantry units seize Parker Strip. And they're going to poke the bear. Parker. Oh no, where is Parker Strip? Or Paker Strip? Just type in Strip. No. I, I just want to really make sure that I know what's going to happen when I do something. Yeah, it's called Parker Strip. Well, we'll see what happens, I guess. Is there any decision I can take now? Oh, Assault on Hoover Dam is done. Good. Jolly good. Kimball's protege. 
Decision leaves troopers. Hmm, that might be very good. Triumph expedition. Oh my gosh, look at that. Following the NCR's victory at Hoover Dam, the Mojave expedition has been recalled with thousands of soldiers returning home. However, to replace them come thousands more here to reinforce the border against the threat to the east. Now and forever, these are NCR lands. That's not bad, but I can't start this because I'm also doing another focus. Okay, my bad. Holy crap, I want all those cores. Holy goodness. Ah, oh, it's 2280. January. Happy 2280, guys. Hope you're having a good, 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 good year. Looks like they're suffering some sort of attrition. Before I forget. Before I forget. We need to make sure we have enough planes in both positions. Now, obviously, our plane uh, manufacturing center isn't the greatest. But it's not bad. Uh, for right now, go ahead and train. Because I'm going to need some more, probably, air XP for, you know, air doctrine. Hopefully, Kaisar doesn't have a ton of planes himself. That would not be very good for us. But, we'll see what happens. I can get even more construction speed. Can I just build, build... Oh, more multi-population. I just, just build. Build everything as much as you can. So, we're at 34,000 population. I'm feeling pretty good about that. The White Legs declared war on the Grabber Territories. New Judea, huh? Not bad. They got their Burn Man rumors. Oh, they're doing New Judea. Keep moving to the right one. It's really on the left. Oh, they're doing... What is this? White Legs Petition. Reward the loyal tribe. So they're not doing lick the bull's wounds just yet. Hmm. I am still justifying, I gotta remember, on Vault 3. But we got like 80 days until then. So, I mean, we have a little bit of time. Armored breastplate. Nice, more defense. I love it. More organization. I think that's pretty good to do. Let's do some more organization. Uh, if I have a spare army somewhere, I don't think I do. Well, I mean, we... I guess I just have a spare army right now. Cool. Thanks, guys. We will have... Eventually, someone is a new leader here. But that's alright. I, I use a lot. Willie Humphreys. Humphreys. Thank you for joining us here. Willie. Uh, for right now, to keep things a little bit more less cluttered, I'll do this. Y'all come over here, and you might as well go ahead and start training so you become, not regulars, or trained, but become regulars, not just train level soldiers. Not bad, not bad. I might, yeah, I probably will have to increase the infrastructure levels here. Salvaged dive bomber, thank god. Salvaged, nuclear salvaged fighter. These bombers are okay. Air Doctrine, I forget which one was the best. I actually think Strategic Destruction was the best now for the meta, but of course, I don't think it, the Air Doctrines have really changed too much. Um, I don't really do Strategic Bombing, especially in this game right now. <clears throat> I use more Close Air Support, and I really want my Close Air Support to do well, so let's go with Formation Flying. Nice, Scrapyard Dive Bombers, yes please, yes please. Increase them. Increase them. Oh, founding Port Eridesh. Nice. We got some vehicle scavengers return. Love it. And next up on our focus is Triumph Expedition. Seven days, more political power, and we get a ton of cores all over the place. Area 6. Sky Reavers. Oh, they're elites. Do they not like us? No, they don't really like us. And he falls ill. Whatever. War Chief. Am I going to go to war with these guys eventually? Maybe not. This looks like the generic tribal focus tree. Ooh, yay. That's good. Actually, I'm going to start throwing you over on, onto this side instead. Very good. Triumph Expedition. Awesome. More po core population. I love it. Founding the river patrol would be nice, but don't really need it. Mojave fortifications. We get a lot of outposts all over the place. And then power to the people. And then the new hard line, which I can go to war with Kaisar's Legion. But as a reminder, we probably got to keep an eye on what they're doing. The white legs. Where are the white legs? Anybody got white legs? I might. Oh. Okay. I see what, that, what that's like. 
Okay, okay, sure, sure. What is that petition to? They're right next to my lands. Um, keep going to the right. Reward the loyal tribe. Mojave fortifications, that's good. Graham's execution. New cohort. Legendary Utah. Oh, they get a lot of cores too. Man, they get a ton of cores. For now, power to the people. We lose production in Hoover Dam, but we just transfer it over to Shady Sands. That's not bad. And the new hard line. Well, I'll do this because it's only seven days. And just in case we get attacked and lose Hoover Dam, we still have the benefits. That'll be great. Oh my gosh. Aaron Kimball. Handsome. So handsome. So, power equipment. Vehicles. I want more equipment. I just want more, 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 more equipment. We need more anti tank still. Power armor is doing very well. I actually might be tempted to make even more power armor divisions. Uh, wait. You're a power armor division. Oh, I was using NCR Heavy Trooper Division. So you've got 66, 13.2, 128, 26. Not bad. You guys, I'm thinking about the last thing for that. Um, honestly, I'm thinking just go balls to the wall and just like 40 width combat divisions that will destroy any sort of supply that it would ever get. But they'll be so good, that doesn't matter, right? That eventually, in the end game, I will make a crap ton of infrastructure. So, that is my planning here. Right now, yeah, you're definitely going to do this. Nice. Alright, how many more days do we have with these guys? I have a core on you guys. That's not bad. You all. Power to the people. Nice. And that was up here. You two, get over here as quick as possible. So, at this point, I could do the new hardline and go to war with the Kaisar's Legion. But, let's let them have a little bit of fun. Get more monthly population gain for a little bit. Weapons, weapon standardization might be good for us so we can get more infantry equipment and whatnot. More soft attack as well. Mayoral victory speech. Dockyards, new industry pitches. Boneyard. Ah, let's do the Boneyard. I haven't done anything with the Boneyard yet, so... And I will end the episode very, very, very soon, so. Alright. With that in mind, this guy's going to come over here. You guys are going to stop training. I want you to prepare. Because when we break into here, we're going to need a lot of supply and a lot of good times to make sure that we actually win. Take over Vault 3. Have a good time with these guys. Oh, we got cores up to Jacobstown. Oh, Jacobstown. I remember Jacobstown. Yeah, it's kind of far away. White Legs declare war on New Canaan. And they... Uh... New Canaan... Wait, NCR. Oh, Rangers. Hellraiser. Wait, when did they join my faction? Where are you? Oh, you've been also fighting with New Reno. Oh, boys, 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 boys. Oh, my goodness. A bunch of crazies. Can I go? I want to go with War Economy, but obviously I can't. I can get a ship designer. And there's really nothing else for me to do, so I might as well go for that, I guess. Alright then, guys. Um, that's pretty much it for today. Uh, what have we done? We had a battle for Hoover Dam, the first battle. It'll be very interesting to see what we do next. And which we go to war with Kaiser's Legion. Obviously, I've been building up a lot of fortifications between me and them. But I'm also going to have to build up quite a few fortifications on my land between me and New Canaan. Or the White Legs, the White Legs, yeah. White legs are terrible. Just remember that, always. Anyways, thank you very much for watching, guys. Leave a like if you liked the video. Subscribe if you're new. And I will see you tomorrow where we might just end up in another war with Kaisar's Legion. And we can go to war with Vault 3. See you tomorrow, guys.